accessory movements, limbs, like leg extension, yeah. um, triceps, always like mentally think of uh, a beat on the beat. All right, guys, we are back. Day seven, part two of the arm training. Okay. That's okay. So having a, a little bit of an arch in your back is normal. So it's actually healthier for your shoulders and puts your shoulders in a good position. So, so you're doing good with that. Like, you're doing great. So keep that up. Um, but with your feet, try... All right, guys, even though we are just training arms on this particular day, there's a lot of good tips um, and a lot of common mistakes that people do. And they're always wondering why their arms are not growing or they're not making gains. You know, they don't have defined arms, muscles. Uh, so we go through a lot in this video and uh, we follow it up with one more video right after this. Uh, so make sure you smash that like button down below uh, that really helps the channel grow brings awareness to the channel and uh enjoy the video uh why don't you guys let me know in the comments down below what your favorite arm exercise is and uh let's see if we uh let's see if we share that common interest Take these off. <laughs> Every time you're working the muscle in general, but in particular, like uh, accessory movements, limbs, like leg extension, yeah. um, triceps, always like mentally think of uh, shortening the muscle and then lengthening the muscle. So like, how do I shorten my tricep? I basically flex it, yeah. right? So this, so you can look, hopefully my tricep pops. Yeah, we can see it. All right, cool, cool. <laughs> so if I go back, uh -huh. without me flexing it, I'm just putting my arm back and it's short. Yeah. Okay? Now, if I come up, if I go the opposite way, it's lengthened, okay? So you wanna, you know, put it all together and think of the same thing when, when you're uh, using the weight. So I'm lengthened and I'm shortening. Lengthening it, and shortening it. Lengthening it, and shortening it. Now, you don't want to like let it go. So I'm gonna lower the weight to show you an example. You don't want to like uh, shorten it and then lengthen it. See how like I kind of lost control of that? Yeah. Because then I could tear my tricep right off. <laughs> so we want to still be in control. So I'm gonna shorten it all the way. Lengthen it, okay, but still be in control. Shorten it and lengthen it. We're not shortening it and then resting. Okay, okay so I see what you're saying. Tension. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Earlier, off camera, we talked about um, starting with whatever hand is weaker or whatever arm or limb or whatever it is. So in her case, it's so a right. Good. Shorten. Lengthen, very good. Good. There it is. Good. If it's a like an accessory, like an arm movement like that, that's okay to get get the other one to help a little bit, okay? Good. Shorten. Lengthen. Ooh, watch out. Good. I know that was only the first set, but can you tell a difference in what we just spoke about? Like, yeah. or what I just mentioned? Like, I don't feel more, it's like more in control. So I don't yeah. feel like. Like you're doing a full body yeah. movement? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's, there's workouts, like the close grip tricep that we just did, where you do want to engage a little bit more muscles. Well, and then clearly, there's stuff. Clearly I still was only able to get like 
get seven and I lowered the weight so like it was just as hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was harder, like, right. Yeah. Like, like, Instead of just yeah, 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 moving it. Yeah. Good job.